In de bankethal van Hotel Torarica werd op 28 juli 2022 de driedaagse training The Essential of Migration Under Auspicium van het ministerie van Buitenlandse Zaken, International Business en Internationale Samenwerking, BIBIS, en de International Organization for Migration, IOM, afgesloten. Het doel was om de ministeries welke te maken hebben met migratie van informatie en advies te voorzien om te komen tot een nationale migratie. Uh, this training, can you tell us exactly what was this training all about? Great. This training is called the Essentials of Migration Management 2.0. It's considered the International Organization for Migration's flagship training program for government officials to learn about the basics and the complexities of international migration and how all of the different areas from uh, de from migration development, migration health, to smuggling and trafficking, how they all intersect and, uh, and influence uh, each government, government ministries, each government official's work. My, uh, I'm with a, a program called the Western Hemisphere Program that works to build capacities in countries throughout Central America, Mexico, and the Caribbean. And uh, as the Caribbean coordinator for this particular project, we go to different countries and implement this training. That's a good question. The, the, the big discussions were really around migration and development. There was really great discussion around uh, diaspora, uh, a lot of discussions around uh, uh, smuggling and trafficking. And there was a great discussion as well on migration and climate change and how climate change can actually affect the movement of people, even in, 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 in Suriname in, with internal movements. And, and what are you going to do with uh, the results now? Are you going to give the results to the uh, Suriname government? Great question. We are going to compile the discussion points and then provide this in, in, a, in a comprehensive report that the government can then use in their, uh, in their larger discussions among ministries as they move towards uh, the creation of a migration policy and a migration strategy. And is there a follow-up? So we've been requested to do a little bit more training with even more government officials and uh, IOM is, will be happy to do that and that way we can get even more information and compile the information so it's even more rich data uh, that come from uh, government officials themselves uh, and, not, uh, and not just from an international organization. We're simply here to facilitate extracting that information and then providing it in a comprehensive manner for the government. <laughs>